We begin today's study of Bible prophecy turning to the last book of the Old Testament, the book of Malachi. 我們今天開始呢,就睇下舊約聖經最後一卷書,叫做馬拉基書. And we're all going to read some very mysterious verses together out loud off the screen. 啊,咁我哋呢,就會喺嗰個熒幕呢,睇下有幾節,啊,睇嚟係奧秘嘅經文嚟㗎. The last two verses of the last chapter of the last book of the Old Testament. 啊, 最后一章的最后两节, Malachi verse four, chapter 4 verses 5 and 6. 就马拉基书四章第五第六节. If you have your Bible, you read it out loud with me, or if you know Chinese, read it from the screen. I'll begin with the English. 啊, Behold, I will send you Elijah the prophet before the coming of the great and dreadful day of the Lord. And he will turn the hearts of the fathers to their children and the hearts of the children to their fathers. Or else I will come and smite the land with a curse. Here is one of the most unusual predictions in all of the Bible. What do these two verses mean? Will Elijah actually return in Hong Kong before Jesus returns the second time? Will an ancient man with a long robe and a, a long white beard and maybe a shepherd's crook appear on television in Taipei? 咁呢好耐之前呢有個人呢著住件長衫長袍長嘅胡鬚白髮揸住支牧羊人嘅杖就喺台北出現。Will he show up at the White House in Washington D.C.? 哦，或者會唔會喺美國嘅白宮出現？Well, Elijah lived 2,800 years ago. 以利亞呢就生活喺2800年前嘅。And then he mysteriously disappeared. 突然間佢就咁樣神秘消失咗啦。And you don't hear about him again till right here in the last. Two verses of the Old Testament. And here it says that Elijah the prophet will appear again before the coming of the great and dreadful day of the Lord. Who is Elijah? Well, there's a man who's been bewitching. Hundreds of thousands of young people. Oh, this man is an automobile manufacturer from Korea. His name is Reverend Sun Young Moon. His followers, like these young people here, are called Moonies. And many of them claim he is Elijah. Is he? You better know. Well, let me explain to you what I believe that this verse means. And then you and I will take our Bibles and you'll decide if I'm right. I believe that this prediction here does not refer to the coming of a man at all. But rather, I believe it refers to the coming of a message similar to Elijah's. And that this message is to appear two times in history. First, it came to prepare people for the first coming of Jesus at Bethlehem. Ah, but second, there will be a special message similar to Elijah's to prepare people for Jesus' second coming. Well, you say, Lonnie, where did you hear that? 啊, 你就說, 哎呀, 馬牧師, 
I heard it by eavesdropping on a conversation between Jesus and the disciples. Ah, 我就喺耶稣基督同佢门徒嘅倾偈嗰当中咧，我就听到喎。In Matthew 17, 喺马太十七章。It says that one day Jesus took three of his closest disciples and they went up on a mountain. 嚇，有一日咧就講到耶穌帶三個最親密嘅門徒咧就上山啦。And verse two says, and he was transfigured before them. 嚇，聖經就講到話第二節咧，佢就喺佢哋面前咧就變了形象。His face shone like the sun. 嚇，佢嘅臉目臉面咧就明亮如日頭。And his clothes became white as the light. 嚇，衣裳咧就潔白如光。You see, God gave Jesus special encouragement just before He went to His death on Calvary's cross. 你知道嗎？上帝咧就要特別鼓勵耶穌，當佢要上十字架受死之前。Now notice verses five and six. 嚇，我哋睇下第五六節啦。While Jesus was still speaking, behold, a bright cloud overshadowed them. 嚇，説話之間咧，突然間有一朵雲彩，光明嘅雲彩咧就遮蓋佢哋啦。And suddenly a voice came out of the cloud, saying, 嚇，突然間咧喺雲嗰度有聲音就出嚟咁講話。This is my beloved son, in whom I am well pleased. Hear him. 哦，呢个就系我嘅爱子，我所喜悦嘅，你哋要听他。And notice when the disciples heard it, they fell on their faces。吓，大家睇下，当门徒听见嘅时候咧，佢哋就俯伏喺地啦。And they were greatly afraid。吓，佢哋极其嘅害怕。But then suddenly it ended。吓，突然间咧就冇咗咯。And the disciples speechless。Headed down the mountain with Jesus. Ah, the 门徒咧就一粒声都冇出咧，就落山啦。But now they were in an awful dilemma. 咁而家咧，佢哋就非常之嘅困惑啦。You see, the disciples too were taught that before Messiah appears, Elijah must come first. 哈，啲门徒咧就被教导咧，当诶。耶穌嚟之前，啊，就呢個以利亞會出現嘅。Well, after this experience, the disciples were convinced that Jesus was Messiah. 嚇！但係佢哋就係相信耶穌就係要嚟嘅尼賽亞啊嘛。Notice verse ten, what their question was. 嚇！我哋睇第十節，佢哋嘅問題點講 ？And the disciples asked him, saying, Why then do the scribes say that Elijah must first come? 咁門徒就問耶穌啦，問是為什麼講話以利亞必須先嚟咧 ？In other words, Lord, if you're Messiah and we believe that you are, where's Elijah？ 佢意思就話：啊，主啊，我哋相信尼賽亞，你就係尼賽亞。咁如果你已經係尼賽，我哋點解仲以利亞喺邊啊 ？Verses eleven and twelve. 嚇，第十一、第十二節啦。Jesus answered and said to them, Indeed, Elijah is coming first and will restore all things. 嚇，耶穌就回答佢哋啦，以利亞就固然先嚟，並要復興萬事。But I say unto you, what did Jesus say? 嚇，只是咧，我就告訴你哋，誒，佢點講啊？ That Elijah has come already. Ha, Elia, ah, 已经嚟咗喎。And they did not know him, but did to him whatever they wished. Ha, 佢哋就唔认识佢，就竟任意待佢啦。Oh, and likewise also, the Son of Man is also about to suffer at their hands. Ha, 人子亦都要将要咁样受佢哋嘅害。Now read together what it says in verse thirteen. Ha, 我哋再睇睇第十三节点样讲。Then the disciples understood that he spoke to them of whom. 哈，門徒咧喺呢個時候先明白耶穌所講嘅係指著邊個講啊 ？John the Baptist. 哈，施洗約翰啦。So clearly, the Elijah of Christ's day was John the Baptist. 咁好清楚咧，就喺基督嘅時代嗰個以利亞咧就係施洗約翰啦。But people hadn't recognized him as John the Baptist or Elijah. 啊，但係啲人就唔知道施洗約翰就係以利亞喎。But the Elijah message that was sent to prepare the way for Christ's first coming was through John the Baptist. 但係呢個以利亞嘅信息咧，就係要預備主嘅來臨咧，就係借住施洗約翰咧，就傳揚開。Now, folks, the conclusions we're about to reach are so important tonight. We want to make absolutely certain that we're correct about this. 啊，咁咧個結論咧係非常之重要咧，我哋一定要係正確嘅，要明嘅。So turn to John chapter one verse nineteen and on. 啊，我哋睇下約翰福音一章第十九節啦。Why don't we ask John the Baptist? Did he admit that he was Elijah? 
點解我哋唔問阿施洗約翰究竟佢承唔承認自己就係以以利亞 ？This is very interesting in verse nineteen and on. 嚇，咁啊，非常之有趣嘅喎。第，我哋睇下第十九節開始啊。Now this is the testimony of John when the Jews sent priests and Levites from Jerusalem to ask him, Who are you? 嚇。啊！約翰所作嘅見證咧，就記在下面啦。猶太人咧就從耶路撒冷差祭司同利未人去到約翰嗰度問佢：你是誰 ？And he confessed and did not deny, but confessed, I'm not the Christ. 嚇！佢咧就講話冇隱瞞咧，我唔係基督。And they asked him, What then? Are you Elijah? 咁跟住佢哋又問啦，咁你係邊個咧？係咪以利亞咧 ？And he said, I am not. 啊！佢話：誒，我唔係。Uh oh, uh oh! Jesus said he was. John said he wasn't. Jesus 话佢系，但系事实上佢自己话唔系喎。And so they press him further. 啊，跟住咧佢就佢哋就要逼下佢。Are you the prophet? 你系咪嗰个先知啊 ？And he answered, No. 佢话，哎，唔系。Then they said to him, Who are you that we may give an answer to those who sent us? Ah, 咁究竟你系边个叫我哋好回复差我哋嚟嘅人 ？What do you say about yourself? 哈，你自己讲你系边个 ？Notice verse twenty-three. Let's read it together. 哈，我哋留意住二十三节。He said, "I am the voice of one crying in the wilderness. Make straight the way of the Lord." 佢就话我就系嗰个喺旷野有人声喊着说修直主嘅道路嘅。He said, "Folks, I'm not Elijah in person. I am a voice similar to Elijah's." 佢就话我唔系以利亚本人，我就系嗰个声音咧，系好似以利亚嘅声音。I bring a message similar to Elijah's. 吓，我带出嚟嘅信息咧，就好似以利亚嘅信息。To prepare the way for Jesus as Messiah. 系要准备耶稣嘅道路，佢就系尼赛亚啦。And Luke chapter one seventeen clears up any mystery about John the Baptist as Elijah before the Messiah came. 咁啊，跟住我哋睇约翰福音第一章十七节咧，就更加清楚啦。Notice what it says. 啊，睇下佢点讲啦。It says he, that's John, will also go before him or the Messiah. 佢就讲到话，他必有以利亚嘅心智能力。他就系指约翰啦。吓 ，in the spirit. And power of Elijah. 哈，佢就会有以利亚嘅心智同埋能力嘅。To turn the hearts of the fathers to the children. 哈，就叫为父嘅心就转向。And the disobedient to the wisdom of the just. 哈，叫悖逆嘅人咧就转从义人。To make a people prepared for the Lord. 又为主预备合用嘅百姓。Now, where did we just read that before tonight? 哈，我哋啱啱读嘅喺边度咧？ It was our first scripture in Malachi 4, verses 5 and 6. 哈，就马拉基书第四章五六节啦。So John wasn't Elijah in person. 所以，施洗约翰咧就唔系以利亚本人。He came in the spirit and in the power of Elijah. 哈，佢就带有以利亚嘅心智同埋能力。This isn't talking about some sort of reincarnation. 啊，呢度唔系讲到嗰啲咩嘅轮回喎。It's talking about a message similar to Elijah's. 哈，就讲紧一个信息咧，系好似以利亚嘅信息嘅。And if you receive it, 啊，如果你接受呢个信息嘅话 ，it becomes Elijah to you. 哈，对你嚟讲咧，呢个就系以利亚。To make sure we understand this, Jesus himself verifies this in Matthew 11 verses 7 and 10. 啊，咁耶稣咧就喺马太福音第十一章。Notice what it says. 啊，我哋睇下佢点讲啦。As they departed, Jesus began to say to the multitudes concerning John. 啊，当佢哋走嘅时候咧，耶稣就对众人讲论诶约翰说啦。What did you go out into the wilderness to see? 啊，你哋从前去旷野系要睇啲咩咧 ？A reed shaken by the wind. 系咪睇下风吹动嘅芦苇啊 ？For this is he of whom it is written. 啊，但系经常记着说咧。Behold, I send my messenger before your face. 哈，我要差遣我嘅使者 ，who will prepare your way before you. 哈，佢就会为你预备道路。And if you're willing to receive it, 哈，如果你若肯领受嘅话 ，He is Elijah who is to come. 哈，这人就是那应当嚟嘅以利亚。Jesus said that. 哈，耶稣咁样讲嘅喎。Now please listen carefully. 哈，请大家留心啲听啦。We found in our very first text in Malachi. 哈，咁我哋喺马拉基书嘅第一个嘅经文咧。
that Elijah must come before the second coming of Jesus Christ. The great and dreadful day of the Lord. But now clearly we see that there was also a parallel fulfillment of that prophecy at Christ's first coming. John the Baptist was the Elijah message preparing the way for Christ's first coming. Ah, but the primary emphasis of Malachi is that before the second coming of Jesus, Elijah will first come. So here's the question tonight. Where is God's last day Elijah message today? To prepare people for the second coming of Jesus Christ. You see, just as there was a special Elijah message before Christ's first coming that prepared the way for Messiah. So you and I today must look for a message similar to Elijah's that will prepare the way for the second coming of Jesus Christ. And do you know what? Such a message is found right in the heart of the book of Revelation. It's God's last call to planet Earth. Oh, and it is strikingly similar to Elijah's message. In fact, it's practically identical. The voice of prophecy speaks again. But why would we call this last day message to our planet the Elijah message? What was Elijah's message? Okay, let's go back to the Old Testament and discover what Elijah's message was. So we can identify what the Elijah message is today. Let's go back to Elijah's message about 910 BC. We find it in 2 Kings chapter 17. Watch carefully these words. Yet the Lord testified against Israel and against Judah by all his prophets. And every seer saying, Turn from your evil ways. And what? Keep my commandments and my statutes. There it is. That's the Elijah message. But it goes on. According to all the law which I commanded your fathers and which I sent to you by my servants the prophets. Nevertheless, they would not hear. But they stiffened their necks. That means they became stubborn. Like the necks of their fathers. Who did not believe in the Lord their God. And notice what they did. And they rejected his statutes and his covenant that he had made with their fathers. And his testimonies, which he had testified against them, they followed idols and became idolaters. And they went, af- they went after the nations who were all around them. Concerning whom the Lord had charged them that they should not do like them. Now please notice verse 16. 
嚇，大家再留意住第十六節。So they left all the commandments of the Lord their God。啊，所以佢哋就離棄耶和華俾佢哋一切嘅戒律。They made for themselves molded images and two calves and made a woman wooden image and worshipped the host of heaven。嚇，佢哋跟住就做咗兩個牛族嘅像，立了亞舍拉，敬拜天上嘅萬象。And they served Baal。跟住佢哋侍奉巴力。Now that word, all the hosts of heaven, means that they worship the sun, they worship the moon, they worship the stars. 哈，天上嘅万象咧，就系佢哋敬拜星星啊、月亮啊、太阳。God's people forgot all about the Ten Commandments and had become sun worshippers. 哈，上帝嘅子民忘记上帝嘅诫命，跟住佢哋成为咩？拜日头。Can you imagine that? 哈，你大家可以想象到嘛 ？I mean, God had placed Israel in that narrow neck of land there in the Middle East. 哈，上上帝将以色列咧就摆喺呢个嘅嘅地方嗰度。That strategic place was so that they could witness for him. 哈，呢個非常之有策略嘅地點咧，以致佢哋可以為上帝做見證。Palestine was the crossroads of all the trade routes of the ancient world. 哈，巴勒斯坦咧就係古代咧所有嘅路嘅中間嚟嘅。Well, instead of witnessing to the heathen, 哈，佢就冇向呢班外邦人見證上帝喎。God's people tramped off after all those strange gods, and they became like the heathen. 上帝嘅子民咧就隨從。其他外邦嘅神就拜咗佢哋嘅神。Now geographically, Israel was surrounded with sun worship。喺地理上面咧，以色列咧就俾周围嗰啲拜太阳嗰啲人咧所围绕住嘅。To the north were the Phoenicians。喺北边咧就有腓尼基人啦。To the south and the west was Egypt。喺南部嗰度、西部咧就有埃及啦。And of course, you've seen pictures of the pyramids. That's all about sun worship。吓，你可以睇到金字塔嘛？金字塔咧就拜日头嘅。And then to the southeast was Edom or Petra, sun worshippers。喺南南边咧就系以东啊，同埋 Petra 嗰度咧，亦都系拜太阳。Well, King Ahab was one of God's chosen people. 亚哈王咧，就上帝其中所拣选嘅子民。Well, instead of marrying one of God's God-fearing young Jewish girls, Ahab went up north and married a pagan Phoenician princess. 啊，佢咧就冇系娶一个诶犹太人敬拜上帝嘅女子为妻，结果咧佢就去到北边咧就娶呢个腓利基嘅公主啦。You know what her name was? What was her name? 啊，佢个名叫做咩啊？ Jezebel. 哈，夜洗别。How many of you mothers named your daughters Jezebel? 哈，有几多个母亲呢？为女儿安名叫做夜洗别啦。Why are you smiling? 哈，点解你笑啊 ？Because Jezebel represents everything evil and wicked. 因为夜洗别代表所有一切邪恶嘅嘢。Jezebel brought 450 pagan fertility prophets of Baal. 嚇！耶洗別咧就引入四百五十個呢咁嘅拜巴力嘅先知。Plus she brought four hundred heathen sun worshipping prophets of the groves。嚇！同埋咧四百個個嗰個外邦派太陽神呢啲咁嘅假先知。And she brought them down to the temple in Jerusalem and fed them with the king's groceries。啊！帶佢入到耶路撒冷嗰啲廟嗰度咧，跟住咧。You can imagine that very soon the whole country of Israel tramped off into apostasy and sun worship. 大家可以想象啦嘛，整个国家咧不久咧就开始背道啦。What did God do? 吓，上帝点做啊 ？He sent Elijah. 佢就差遣咗以利亚啦。With a stern message to Israel and King Ahab. 系有一个好严厉嘅信息俾以色列同埋亚哈王。Ahab, because you've forsaken the commandments of God. 亚哈，因为你离弃上帝嘅诫命。Notice. What it says in chapter 17, verse 1. 哈，我哋睇下列王记上第十七章。As the Lord God of Israel lives, before whom I stand. 哈，我指着所侍奉永生耶和华以色列嘅上帝起誓。There shall be no dew nor rain these years except at my word. 哈，这几年我若果唔祷告咧，必不降露，必不下雨。Ahab, there will not even be any dew for three and a half years. 啊哈，唔会有露水嘅喺三年半当中。Then Elijah. Disappeared. Oh, 跟住以利亚咧就消失咗啦。And he hid. 啊，佢就匿埋。And sure enough, there was no rain. 啊，当然咧就冇落到雨啦。Everything dried up. 啊，每一样咧都干晒啦。Well, Elijah was the most hunted man alive. 啊，以利亚咧就被通缉噶啦。
Ahab's secret police were out looking for him. And suddenly, after three and a half years, Elijah shows up. And he appears right at the palace with a message for Ahab. Notice Kings, 1 Kings 18, verses 17 and on. Then it happened. When Ahab saw Elijah, that Ahab said to him, Is that you, O troubler of Israel? And he answered, I have not troubled Israel, but you and your father's house have. In that you have forsaken the commandments of the Lord and you have followed the Baals. Now therefore, send and gather all Israel to me at Mount Carmel. The 450 prophets of Baal. And the 400 prophets of Asherah who eat at Jezebel's table. So Ahab sent for all the children of Israel. Gathered the prophets together on Mount Carmel. I've stood on that very spot. Oh, what a thrill to think of what happened there. The showdown of all the ages. Because this was essentially the ultimate Olympics contest. Elijah stands up all alone. You sun worshippers and you temple prostitutes. You build an altar. You put a sacrifice on it. I'll do the same over here for my God. Now we'll each call on our gods of fire and rain. And we'll see which God will burn up our sacrifice. But you can't use any matches and no tricks. King Ahab, you go first. And Elijah watched carefully. They couldn't make any fire come down. The Bible says they began to dance and holler around there. The Bible says they hollered all day long. Oh, Baal, hear us, hear us, oh, Baal. And the Bible says they begin to cut themselves with knives. And at evening they were so exhausted. And Elijah came forward. And he quietly rebuilt his little altar to the Lord. He carefully laid some wood on it. And he laid a sacrificial animal on it. And then the Bible says that Elijah dug a great big trench all around that altar. And he ordered 12 barrels of precious water to be poured over that sacrifice in the altar. And then the Bible said Elijah knelt down. Now they'd been jumping around that other altar all day long. Your Bible says that Elijah prayed a very simple prayer. It lasted only 90 seconds. Instantly fire flashed from heaven like lightning. It burned up the sacrifice. It burned up the wood. It disintegrated the stones. And it even licked up the water in the trench all around it. Because he who made the atom knows how to control it. And then verse 21 says, and Elijah came to all the people. And he said, 
佢就講話 ：How long will you falter between two opinions？ 嚇，你哋心持異議要到幾時咧 ？If the Lord is God， follow Him。如果上帝係真神嘅，你就跟從佢啦。But if Baal， follow Him。如果巴力係真神嘅，你就跟從佢啦。But the people answered him not a word。但係啲人咧就冇回答到佢。Ladies and gentlemen， 嚇，各位朋友。Elijah's message was to call people away from paganism and sun worship. 以利亚嘅信息咧就叫啲人咧唔好随从外邦同埋拜太阳。It was a call for the human race to go back to obeying the commandments of God. 就叫人类咧就系再一次系敬拜上帝同埋遵从佢嘅诫命。But you say, Lonnie, why does God call his last message? The Elijah message. 但系你就问马牧师，点解上帝称佢嘅信息，以利亚嘅信息就系末日嘅信息 ？We're not pagans who worship the sun. 啊，我哋唔系嗰啲外邦人拜太阳喎。Or do we? 或或者我哋系咪咧 ？Let me take you back to the earliest days of civilization. 吓，让我带大家翻到去咧历史嘅最初期嘅时候。This is where civilization began at the Tigris and Euphrates River in old Nineveh. 哈，我哋就翻翻人類嘅歷史最初嗰度咧，就喺嗰條誒幼弗拉底河嗰度。Our ancient heathen forefathers. 哈，我哋嗰啲好誒嗰啲外邦嘅祖宗咧。They worshipped life. 哈，佢哋就敬拜生命嘅。And therefore, anything that was sexually reproductive. 哈，所以任何嘢。係同生產同性有關嘅。I don't need to get into all the details because this is very, very uncomfortable. 嚇，我唔需要講得太詳細啦，因為聽起上嚟唔係好舒服。They worship the bull. 嚇，佢哋拜嗰個牛啦。Particularly sex organs. 嚇，特別係佢嘅性器官啦。They worship the sun. They worship the moon. They worship the stars. 佢哋拜太陽啦、月亮啦、星星啦。They worship rivers. They worship trees. 嚇，佢哋亦亦都拜啲河流啊、樹木啊。But they especially worship the female egg. 佢哋特別敬拜嗰個咩？拜嗰個女性嗰個卵子。Well, their legends had it. This wasn't true, but it was a legend. 嚇，呢個呢個唔係真嘅，但係佢哋嘅神話咧就咁樣講到。Legends had it that an egg of wondrous size fell out of heaven into the river Euphrates. 嚇，咁咧就講到咧一個好大嘅卵子咧喺天上咧就跌落呢個幼發拉底河嗰度。Fish nosed it up on the bank. 嚇，咁啲魚咧就咁樣遊曬上岸啦。Then doves. Settle down on that giant egg. Oh, 咁啲白鸽咧就落到嚟呢个大嘅卵子度。And out hatched Ishtar. 啊，跟住咧就孵出咗伊斯塔啦。Ishtar had a baby boy without a human father. 啊，伊斯塔咧就有一个男婴，但系冇父亲嘅喎。You see, centuries before Jesus, Satan even counterfeited the virgin birth of Christ in heathen mythology. 大家知道嘛？喺耶穌出生之前幾個世紀啊，撒旦已經喺度冒啦，假假冒呢個咁嘅誒童女誕生呢個故事。And Tammuz was born about the twenty-fifth of December. 啊，呢個塔姆斯咧就喺十二月二十五號出世嘅。Have you heard of that date before？ 大家有冇聽過十二月廿五號咧 ？Then Tammuz was killed by a wild boar in the springtime. 啊，咁塔姆斯咧就俾一隻野豬咧就殺死咗啦。But the legend said he was resurrected every spring on the first day of the week following the vernal equinox, or at Easter. Ah, 咁個神話就講咧，佢咧就每年喺春天春分嘅時候咧，喺就嗰個有有一日咧就會復活啦。What I'm trying to tell you, friend, is this. 嚇，我嘗試講俾大家聽咧，就係咁樣。Everything in the Bible has been counterfeited by Satan in heathenism. 嚇，聖經所講嘅嘢咧，就俾撒旦咧，藉住嗰啲外邦嗰啲神話咧，就要假冒啦。Now, please don't misunderstand me. 嚇，大家唔好誤會喎。There's nothing morally wrong with Easter. 嚇，誒道德上嚟講，我哋睇唔到復活節有咩錯。Or singing Christmas carols at Christmas。啊，或者聖誕節喺度唱歌，亦都冇乜錯嘅。Everyone though knows that Jesus was not born on December 25。每一個人都知道耶穌唔係喺十二月二十五號出世嘅。And this little book I told you about the other day tells all about these legends from heathen mythology。嚇，咁呢本書我同大家分享到咧，就講到嗰啲外邦所講嘅一切神話。But here's my point. Listen carefully. If Christianity and all those Christian churches you see around this city 
嚇、啊。如果整個基督教我哋周圍所有嘅教會 ，if they are so riddled with the remnants of sun worship， 嚇、啊，如果佢哋俾嗰啲拜太陽嗰啲。嗰啲嘢咁樣喺基督教嗰度睇到嘅話 ，Could it be that our whole world today is infected with sun worship too？ 嚇，如果喺基督教都睇到拜太陽嗰啲影子，究竟今日我哋係咪受呢個拜太陽嗰啲影響咧 ？And the answer is a resounding yes。個答案就係啦。That's why God gave us the Elijah message right in the heart of Revelation chapter fourteen。咁點解上帝咧喺末日要俾我哋以利亞嘅信息咧？就係、是。Just before the coming of the great and dreadful day of the Lord, 就喺呢个上帝大而可畏来临之日。Is this message? 吓，就系呢一个嘅信息。Folks, that's us. 呢呢个就系我哋啦，朋友。In fact, just jump ahead two verses and to verses fourteen and fifteen. 吓，我哋睇前两节就第十四、十五两节。These are the most glorious picture of the second coming of Jesus in all of the Bible. 吓，呢个咧就系圣经所讲到最荣耀嘅日子，有关耶稣复活。John says, "Then I looked, and behold, a white cloud." 吓，约翰就话，哎，我又观看，啊，见到一片白云。And on the clouds sat one like the Son of Man. 吓，云上坐咗一位好似人子咁。Having on his head a gold Golden crown. Ha! His head bears a gold crown. And in his hand a sharp sickle. Ha! His hand bears a sharp sickle. Ha! His hand bears a sharp sickle. And another angel came out of the temple. Ha! 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 Another angel That's talking about Jesus coming. 哈，呢个就讲到耶稣嘅复临。Now, immediately, just before these verses of the second coming of Jesus, John describes the Elijah message of our day. 哈，就喺呢几节经文之前咧，就讲到呢个以利亚信息，就系今日俾我哋嘅信息。A message that's identical to Elijah's. 哈，呢个信息咧就同以利亚嘅信息一样嘅。To call us away from pagan sun worship and back to God's ten commandments. 叫我哋唔好再好似外邦咁样拜太阳，而系转敬拜上帝。Please notice each verse. We'll begin with verse six. 哈，我哋留意住每一节啦，第六节开始。Then I saw another angel flying in the midst of heaven. 哈，跟住我就看见有一位天使系飞喺空中。Having the everlasting gospel to preach to those who dwell on the earth. 有永遠嘅福音要傳俾住喺地上嘅人。To every nation, every tribe and tongue and people， 就係各個各族各方各民。So you see, this is a worldwide message. Hong Kong, Moscow, New York, everywhere。嚇，大家知道嘛？呢個係全世界嘅信息。香港、莫斯科、紐約。It's the Elijah message。呢個就係以利亞嘅信息。And that message is of what？ 嚇、啊！呢、这個係咩信息嚟咧 ？It's of the everlasting gospel。係呢個永遠嘅福音。This is not going to be something brand new and strange。啊！呢個唔係一啲好新好怪嘅嘢。It's not going to be invented by some man。啊！亦都唔係人所發明嘅。No, it's the very same gospel that God gave to Adam。係就係同一個福音，上帝俾亞當。Same gospel that was given to Noah。同一個福音，上帝俾羅亞嘅。And Jesus。耶穌嘅。And the apostles。啊！亦都嗰啲使徒。In its current setting for 2010。就喺二零一零年呢个情况底下，吓，亦都系俾呢个末日嘅时候，所有你同我生活。A message of salvation in Jesus Christ. Just this, just in Christ, we get saved. Not by our works. Ah, 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 Mm, the continent of Africa was a closed book. 喺誒呢個非洲呢個大陸咧係封閉嘅。Most of Asia was asleep to the gospel. 大部分嘅亞洲咧對福音嚟講都係瞓著覺。India was shut tight. 嚇，印度嘅門都係關咗嘅。But what happens in Hong Kong today is known seconds later in London by satellite. 但係今日我哋喺香港發生嘅事啊，幾秒鐘之後啊，就靠住人造衛星喺倫敦都知道。You see, friend, this gospel message could be finished overnight. 大家知道嘛？呢、这個信息啊，我哋可以一夜之間就傳遍。And this is the last message Revelation says in verse seven. 嚇，呢個咧就啟示錄所講嘅最後嘅信息啦。That's why it's the Elijah message. 所以呢個點解係以利亞嘅信息 ？And what is that? 啊，究竟係咩咧 ？Verse seven. 
第七節。The angel says with a loud voice. 嚇、啊！呢、这個天使有個大聲就咁樣講話。Fear God and give glory to Him. 嚇、啊！敬應當敬畏上帝，將榮耀歸給他。Doesn't say give glory to Brother Melashenko. 嚇、啊！唔係話將榮耀歸俾阿馬牧師喎、哦。Give glory to Him. 嚇、啊！將榮耀歸給他。For the hour of His judgment is come. 因為佢施行審判嘅時候已經到啦。And worship Him who made the heaven, the earth. And the seas and the springs of waters. 哈，应当敬拜那创造天地海同埋众水泉源。It says judgment is here. 佢话审判已经嚟到啦。So worship the Creator. 所以敬拜呢个创造主。Do you see how relevant the Elijah message is for us today? 大家睇唔睇到呢个以利亚信息对我哋今日嚟讲系几咁重要 ？It's a message for our last days about judgment. 系呢个系对我哋末日嚟讲系一个审判嘅信息。Worship Him. 哈，当敬拜佢。Who、uh, made the earth through millions of years of evolutionary processes through fang and tooth and claw? Oh,、uh, 或者佢创造呢个世界透过唔知几多亿亿万万年咁样进化而成。Is that what it says? 系咪咁样讲咧 ？Worship him who what? 吓、啊、敬拜边一位啊 ？The Creator who made heaven and earth. 就系呢个创造天地海嘅主。So you see, right in this message, in the heart of this message, is the fourth commandment about the Sabbath. 所以喺呢個信息嘅中心咧，就講到係呢個安息日敬拜呢個創造。The Sabbath is the commandment that reminds us to worship Him as the Creator who made everything on earth。安息日呢條界面咧，就提醒我哋要敬拜呢個創造天地海嘅主。Ah, but notice now there are three angels' messages。啊，但係留意到呢度有三天使嘅信息。And these three constitute the Elijah message。呢三個天使信息咧，就組成咗以利亞信息。就係為我哋今日嘅。One。To get back to the Ten Commandments. 第一就我哋要翻翻到十條戒。But then the second angel swoops down and says this. 哦，跟住有第二個天使就咁樣講話。Babylon is fallen. 巴比倫，巴比倫傾倒啦。Now that's not talking about Baghdad. 嚇、啊，唔係講緊巴格達喎、哦。Talking about spiritual Babylon. 嚇、啊，講緊屬靈嘅巴比倫。It says spiritual religions of the world have become confused. 嚇、啊，呢、这個屬靈嘅宗教喺世上咧，已經係非常之混亂啦。Oh, but then we go to verse eight. 嚇、啊，跟住我哋睇下第八節。And another angel followed, saying. 嚇、啊，又有第二位天使接著説。Babylon is fallen, is fallen, that great city. 嚇、啊，巴比倫大城傾倒了，傾倒了。Because she's made all nations drink of the The wine of the wrath of her fornication. Friend, what that is saying is this. All man-made religions have become confused. Ha, 所有人造嘅宗教咧，令到我哋非常之混乱。They're just philosophical babble. 啊，好似嗰啲哲学上面暗暗沉沉咁讲。And it's saying that even the churches of our world have bought into sun worship. 甚至乎我哋嘅教会咧，亦都引入拜太阳啊。Modern churches have become like Jezebel. 哈，现代嘅教会咧，就好似耶洗。Bible calls them Babylon. 圣经就称之为巴比伦。They're giving a lot of confusion. Confused signals to people. Ah, he gives out many confusing signals. And the Bible says billions of people are getting spiritually drunk. The Bible says billions of people are getting spiritually drunk. The Bible says billions of people are getting spiritually drunk. The Bible says billions of people are getting spiritually drunk. The Bible says billions of people are getting spiritually drunk. The Bible says billions of people are getting spiritually drunk. The Bible says billions of people are getting spiritually drunk. The Bible says billions of people are getting spiritually drunk. The Bible says billions of people are getting spiritually drunk. The Bible says billions of people are getting spiritually drunk. The Bible says billions of people are getting spiritually drunk. Come out of her, my people. 哈，我嘅子民啊，你从嗰度出嚟啦。Be not partakers of her sins. 哈，你唔好参与佢哋所犯嘅罪啊。But then the third angel in Revelation 14:9-11. 哈，跟住咧第三个信息系就喺第九到第十一节。The third part of Elijah's message. It swoops down to us. 啊，第以利亚信息嘅第三部分咧就临到我哋。And it's the most dire message of all. 哈，呢个咧就所有信息嘅非常之严厉咁样。For all the great world's religions are in, infected with sun worship. 哈，呢个世界所有嘅宗教咧都受到呢个拜太阳所影响影响嘅。I'm almost afraid to read these words. 哈，当我读呢啲。话嘅时候咧，好惊。Then the third angel followed them, saying with a loud voice. 吓，跟住第三位天使接着佢哋大声讲话。If anyone worships the beast and his image， 吓，若有人拜兽和兽像 ，and receives his mark on his forehead or in his hand， 吓，在额上或者在手上受咗印记。
。哦，他 himself shall drink of the wine of the wrath of God。哈，这人也必喝上帝大怒嘅酒。Which is poured out full strength in the cup of his indignation。哈，这就浸喺上帝嘅愤怒杯中，纯一不杂。And he shall be tormented with fire and brimstone in the presence of the holy angels and in the presence of the Lamb。佢喺圣天使同埋羔羊面前喺火同埋硫磺中受痛苦。And the smoke of their torment ascends forever and ever。佢受痛苦嘅烟就往上冇，直到永永远远。They have no rest day or night。吓，佢哋日昼夜都不得安宁。Whoever worships the beast in his image。吓，嗰啲拜兽同埋兽像嘅。And whoever receives the mark of his name。吓，就会受佢名嘅印记嘅，就昼夜不得安宁。There's no more frightening words in all of Bible prophecy。吓，圣经嘅预言当中冇冇其他比呢段更加令人震惊。Perhaps we'll study about the mark of the beast on another future night。嚇，或者我哋將來咧再會研究一下受印受嘅印記。Because that is history's final act of sun worship。嚇，呢個咧就係歷史當中話拜太陽嘅最後一個嘅。And you'll watch it on TV. It'll be worldwide sun worship, and it's still coming. The Bible says。你睇下電視咧，就就有一個全世界會拜太陽嘅聖經就咁樣講。But I want to fast forward right now to verse 12。Notice what the results, what the fruit of Elijah's message is just before Jesus comes. 哈，我哋睇下以利亚呢个以利亚信息呢个结果系点样咯 ？Here's what God's looking for when He sends us today the Elijah message. 哈，呢个咧就上帝希望睇到个结果，当佢。Uh, you see, it must be the same result as the first Elijah. 个结果信息咧一定会同第一个以利亚信息系一样嘅喎。And the same result as John the Baptist. 啊，亦都系同施洗约翰嘅信息结果系一样嘅喎。Only this Elijah message prepares us for the final conflict. 啊，只有呢一个以利亚信息能够准备好我哋面对最后嗰个嘅困难。For the second coming of Jesus. That's why Jesus got full of love. So that God can point to His universe and say, "Look, ha!" So they can point to the universe and say, "Look, ha!" So they can point to the universe and say, "Look, ha!" So they can point to the universe and say, "Look, ha!" So they can point to the universe and say, "Look, ha!" So they can point to the universe and say, "Look, ha!" So they can point to the universe and say, "Look, ha!" So they can point to the universe and say, "Look, ha!" So they can point to the universe and say, "Look, ha!" So they can point to the universe and say, "Look, ha!" So they can point to the universe and say, "Look, ha!" So they can point to the universe and say, "Look, ha!" So they can point to the universe and say, "Look, ha!" So they can point to the universe and say, "Look, ha!" So they can point to the universe and say, "Look, ha!" So they can point to the Who keep the commandments of God and the faith of Jesus? They are the ones who keep the commandments of God and the faith of Jesus. Do you see it, friends? Do you see it, friends? God's last day saints are simply people who keep the commandments of God. God's last day saints are simply people who keep the commandments of God. God's last day saints are simply people who keep the commandments of God. God's last day saints are simply people who keep the commandments of God. God's last day saints are simply people who keep the commandments of God. 佢哋就有耶穌嘅真道，耶穌嘅信心。Evidently, commandment keeping and the faith of Jesus go together. 嚇，我哋睇到咧，上帝嘅戒命、守上帝嘅戒命同埋耶穌嘅真道咧，係合埋一齊。Our friend, this is profoundly significant. 嚇，呢個對我哋嚟講係非常之深刻同埋重要。Because the Elijah message of the Old Testament was to keep all ten of the commandments. 因為舊約聖經講到以利亞嘅信息咧，就係遵守十條戒命。We just read that the Elijah message of Jesus. Jesus' day with John the Baptist. 哈，我哋啱啱读到喺耶稣时代施洗约翰嗰个以利亚嘅信息。Was the very same. 哈，亦都系一样咯。A call to return to the Ten Commandments. 哈，就一个呼召，呼召啲人再翻到去十条诫命。And so the final message for our day before the great and dreadful day of the Lord. 哈，所以喺呢个最后嘅以利亚信息喺耶和华大而可畏日子未临到之前。Again, it's to keep the Ten Commandments. 再一次就系要守上帝嘅。The Elijah message is the same. 哈，呢个以利亚嘅信息系一样嘅喎。Jesus says to us, America, China, Africa. 耶稣对美国、中国、非洲就咁样讲话。If you love me, 啊，如果你爱我嘅话 ，keep my commandments. 你就遵守我嘅命令。Revelation 14:6 says that this Elijah message. 哈。誒、uh, 啟示錄十四章第六節講到呢個以利亞信息咧 ，is to be proclaimed worldwide, every nation, kindred, tongue, and people。就向全世界嘅宣揚，就係各國各族、各方各民。By satellite, by radio, by television。借住人造衛星、電台同埋。By the Discover Bible course, 啊同埋呢個尋寶嘅函授 ，which is available worldwide on the internet。嚇喺互聯網上面咧，全世界都有嘅。
God's voice of prophecy to the world. And that is being fulfilled tonight, right now, through this evangelistic series. I thank God we're helping to do that. Because notice immediately after this Elijah message of Revelation 14 is given. When that message is given worldwide, Jesus comes. Notice verse 14. And I looked, and behold, a white cloud, and on the cloud sat one like the Son of Man. Having on his head a golden crown, and in his hand a sharp sickle. Folks, could anything be clearer? God's special Elijah message for our world today is these three angels' messages. This message prepares a last day people for the second coming of Jesus. And that's why the devil doesn't want this message study. My friends, listen to me. There's nothing more important. I know this, this might be some new light to some of you. But notice 1 John 1 7. But if we walk in the light as he is in the light, we have fellowship with one another, and the blood of Jesus Christ, His Son, cleanses us from all sin. friend, the Bible says we must walk in the light. I remember in our first year of marriage that Jeannie and I decided to go on a camping trip. We'd never been camping before. We didn't have any sleeping bags. We just slept on a table. Out in the desert. Oh, it was very dark out there. And I discovered something about Jeannie. Jeannie's afraid of the dark. And right in the middle of the night, guess what happened? She had to go to the bathroom. But I had to go with her. I had a little flashlight. And as long as Jeannie walked in the light of that flashlight, and kept moving forward, we made progress. Friend, it's the same today. We are living in a frightening world of spiritual darkness. Jesus, through the preaching of his Elijah message, is shining light here into the lives of billions of people. A loving invitation to China and Asia and Europe to follow Jesus and follow his light. To step out of confusion and Babylon and start to walk in the light of God's word. Be born again. Obey all for Jesus. And then begin fellowship begin with millions of other people worldwide who have heard this message and accepted it and followed Jesus. There's at least 20 to 25 million more people who've discovered the same thing. And they've stepped out of darkness and they're following the light of God's word. And as we do that, the Bible says the blood of Jesus cleanses us from all sin. Ah, if we walk in the light. So you see, we must make a choice to obey. 
大家知道嘛？我哋要做一个决定，要顺从上帝。Suppose I come and I listen to these lectures。吓吓，或者假若我系出席参加呢啲嘅聚会。And yes, pastor, I see truth。啊啊，系啊，阿牧师啊，我睇到呢个真理。But what you're sharing is inconvenient。但你所分享嘅嘢咧，就带嚟好多唔方便。Can I ignore it and just disobey? Ah, 我可唔可以忽略佢哋？誒，跟住唔唔聽佢話。God says no. 上帝話唔得。If I don't walk in the light, the blood no longer cleanses me. 如果我唔行喺光中，耶穌個血唔再洗淨我啦。When I was a little lad, I grew up on a farm in Western Canada. 嚇，當我係一個細路仔嘅時候咧，我就加拿大一個農場嗰度長大。We、so、we were no、嚇，我哋咧就喺一個好鄉下嘅地方咧，係冇電嘅。Well, Dad would go out to the barn to milk the cows. 嚇，爸爸咧就去到農場嗰度咧就揸牛奶啦。And he would carry with him a lantern. 嚇，就帶住一個燈籠喎。I was afraid of the dark when I was a little boy. 嚇、啊，我細路仔嘅時候咧就好怕黑。I would follow right beside it. 唉，我就咁樣跟住佢啦。And I'd say, Daddy, the light reaches such a little way. 嚇、啊，佢爸爸話：，誒，嗰啲光點照得咁前咁近嘅地方。Maybe there's some sort of a boogeyman or a ghost out there. 哦，或者唔知周圍仲有啲咩嘢添。It looks so scary with all those shadows. 哇，嗰啲黑黑影啊，嗰啲哇，好得人驚啊。My daddy would take my hand. 啊，我爸爸咧就捉住我嘅手。And he would say, Yes, son. 啊，佢就話：仔啊。But if you Walk in the light. 佢話：如果你行喺呢個光中間 ，it will take you safe to the end of the journey. 嚇，佢會帶到你行完你呢個路程。Friend, listen. 朋友啊，聽住。God wants to take you by the hand. 上帝希望捉住你隻手，帶領你。And His light in His Word leads just but one step at a time. 嚇，上帝嘅話語就係佢嘅光咧，就會一步一步引領我哋。But he promises to lead you safe to the end of the journey。佢就答應會帶領我哋行完呢個路程。I invite you to place your hand into your heavenly Father's hand。嚇，我邀請大家將你嘅手就放喺上帝嘅手度。And then follow him。跟住咧就跟隨佢。And obey。跟住順從佢 ，just one step at a time。就每一次就一步行。And first John one seven promises。嚇，約翰一書一章七節咁樣答應佢。If we walk in the light as He is in the light。嚇，我哋如果喺光明中行，如同上帝喺光明中。We have fellowship with one another。嚇，我哋就彼此相。And the blood of Jesus Christ His Son cleanses us from all sin。嚇，佢兒子耶穌嘅血亦都洗淨我一切嘅罪。I want you to make that decision tonight。我希望大家今晚喺做呢个嘅决定。